Here's how to elevate basic ramen into a more complete meal. Bloop, bloop. Into the hot tub. Don't overcook your noodles. Ramen should have a little bit of chew. Drain these. I stashed these steaks in the freezer for about 15 minutes just to get them firm. This makes cutting thin slices easier. Salt, pepper, baking soda to tenderize, cornstarch to seal in juices. Mix this all up so it's evenly coated. Just need a little touch of oil in the bottom. Now we can saute our beef. And I'm using the same pot I cooked those noodles in. Once that beef is no longer pink, I can add it to my noodles. This looks so good already. For the rest of this recipe, I'm gonna add in bell pepper and onion. Saute that for 30 seconds. Now I can add my water. While this comes up to a boil, let's season it. We're not gonna use the whole flavor packet, just a little bit. We're gonna enhance our soup broth with our own flavors, like soy sauce. And my secret is mushroom powder, which adds a depth of flavor without adding salt. This is boiling, now it's time to add my broccoli and mushrooms. Final assembly for our beef and broccoli noodles. Top that with a little sesame oil and some green onion.